Hi, I'm Steve Pollitt. Sorry for the shadows in the background. Having a little technical difficulty this evening, uh, but I'm pretty sure this is going to work because I'm now using my phone. I was trying to use my computer so I could see people joining me much easier, but that doesn't seem to be working this evening. So we're going to go with this and uh, the way I start out this presentation is the way I start out my presentations each week on Tuesday evenings when we have a meetup and then a presentation uh, on health and nutrition, healthy living, circulation, and more. So to start with, I want to explain to you why understanding PEMF technology is so important in relationship to your appreciation of any discussion on nutrition, water, healthy lifestyle, exercise, and all of it. In my opinion, this particular topic is the missing link with what most people talk about when they advise us on food and more, which we consider to be uh, part of a healthy lifestyle. So um, with that, I'm going to tell you that there are three main benefits to PEMF technology and especially the device that I represent in that niche, which is scientifically proven to be far more effective than any other device out there that considers themselves or labels themselves a competitor. And I can prove that to you, but that's not the point of this video. I want you to understand the benefits. The benefits are, number one, it balances our electrical systems. So each one of us has a sympathetic and parasympathetic electrical system in our body. That's our fight and flight system and our calming system. So when we're stressed, um, our calming system starts working to bring us back into balance. There's a lot of things that throw that electrical system out of balance. I just mentioned one of them, which is stress. Another is uh, EMF uh, radiation, which is radiation from cell phones, cell towers, and things like that, um, and uh, toxins and chemicals. All these things that influence our health influence our electrical systems, and it's important to understand that we are electrical before we are chemical. Every chemical reaction in our body is influenced first by an electrical charge. So our electrical systems are extremely important, and if we're too charged, that's out of balance, or not charged enough, that's out of balance, and our cells cannot get uh, what they need to do their job, and so on and so forth. So the device I represent balances our electrical systems and it grounds us to the Earth's crust. So using it eight minutes twice a day, that's what it does for our electrical system. The grounding piece is really important because our heart and our brains are intended to operate in the frequency of the Earth's crust. And typically it doesn't, I don't know about you, but right now you can't tell, but I'm wearing a pair of shoes. You may be wearing a pair of shoes or you may be barefoot in your own home, but you could be barefoot in your own home and still walking on flooring, um, whether it's carpet, wood flooring, tiling, whatever the case might be. So you're insulated from the frequency of the Earth's, Earth's crust, and that's part of what this device does. The second benefit is the increase in the blood flow uh, in our entire circulation system, and especially our micro vessel system, which is 74% of our total uh, circulation. Now that's really, really important because guess what? If a cell's not getting the, uh, for the cells to get the nutrition and water uh, that they need and to eliminate waste that they need and get the oxygen that they need, there has to be adequate uh, circulation. And as time goes on, the same things that influence our electrical system, meaning stress, EMF, toxins and chemicals, uh, aging, uh, influence our blood circulation. And that rate of circulation in our microvessel system slows down, and when it slows down, then our, uh, the operational, the functionality of our cells are impaired. When they're impaired, they can't reproduce a perfectly uh, 
perfect cell that replicates themselves, so they reproduce an impaired cell, and then that goes on and on and on, and that begins to become the process of the start of sickness and disease. So circulation is extremely important, and the device I represent increases the circulation by 32%, absorption of oxygen, water, nutrition by 32%, in all of our systems, including our microvessel system, and hardly anything influences the circulation in our microvessel system. So when you hear people talk about health, nutrition, healthy lifestyle, and so forth, they talk about uh, most of what can be measured, which is in our macro system, heart, veins, and arteries, muscles, bones, and things like that. That can be measured. The microvessel system cannot easily be measured but we've measured it, we've tested it, the science is there, uh, real-time videos, uh, all that information is available. I'm happy to share that with you if that's your level of interest. So the third benefit also has to do with what goes on in our cells, which is the elimination of waste. And so our lymphatic system is part of that, and the influence on our lymphatic system of the device I represent is also significant and even more significant to know that literally hardly anything really influences the flow of our lymphatic fluid. So um, bouncing electrical systems, grounding us part of the electrical system, circulation, detox, uh, that's why this system is an amazing uh, anti-aging and detox device when, when coupled with the other things that I'm now going to talk about. So what we consume, we circulate. Think about that. So I love the analogy, I read it in a book uh, recently, where if you had a, uh, let's say a, a million dollar thoroughbred racehorse, uh, let's say it was gifted to you. Uh, now, and you had also the facilities to take care of it, the track to train it, and whatever, you would meticulously take care of that racehorse. You would feed it the best feed, you would have the best, you would regularly exercise it, you would take care of it um, like the prized uh, animal that it is. And yet, we're at least that valuable, if not more. And look how we treat ourselves. We treat ourselves to processed food, foods laden with sugar, trans fats, and worse, toxins and chemicals. We're poisoning our bodies, and we're influenced by that, by the, uh, by the marketing of companies that sell these products. Believe me, I could be coming back from a workout, from walk and run or whatever the case might be and I typically drive to those locations because well when I drive 15 minutes I'm at the water or the, or the uh, gym is maybe 15 minutes from my house so I'm driving and I see the billboards. A lot of these pictures look pretty inviting until I really think through the composition of that food and the composition of the drinks that they're promoting with that food, and then I understand the marketing's winning, and we're not thinking it through, and we're losing. Now let's talk about healthy eating, healthy water. What does that mean? Well, I follow quite a few nutritional experts, and these experts um, are very focused on diet. And you'll get different points of view on what they favor. And they have science to back up what they favor. And I like listening to them. I like paying attention to them. And there are differences, but there are some commonalities. And one of them I mentioned, there, everybody's in agreement on what's not good for you. Okay. So now we get into what is good for you. Well, organic is better for you than non-organic. Non-GMO is better for you than GMO. Okay. So... That's when it comes to uh, plants, uh, fruits, and vegetables. And, uh, and the same is true for what is fed to 
animal protein, cattle, pigs, chickens, things like that. How are they raised? Uh, what are they fed? Because what they are fed goes into us when we consume those products. Same is true for fish. What they are encountering in their environment goes into us if we're eating fish. So a statistic that I heard today was farm-raised fish is 10 times more toxic than wild fish. Having said that, wild fish also contains a great deal of a certain type of toxins. And um, I'm going to reference that very soon because I just listened to that podcast today from a doctor that I really, really enjoy. And he was citing some amazing data that was actually very scary. So what do you do? What do you do with all of this influence of toxins and chemicals? Even if you take organic uh, fruits and vegetables and uh, non-GMO, and you start thinking about, well, what's the nutritional content of the soil in which they were grown? And it's depleted. It's depleted. And even uh, when they're harvested, they're influenced by, um, they're influenced by the toxins and chemicals in the water and the air and the environment. So right now, um, standing here talking with you in my home, I'm surrounded by walls that have been painted or covered in flooring that's been, you know, that includes uh, wood and tile, and then there's coverings on the chairs and so on. And, so. and guess what? Every one of those things has toxins and chemicals. Can't avoid it. Can't avoid it. And I'm standing here in front of uh, my phone. I was in front of my computer, but both are e sources of EMF radiation, electronic magnetic field radiation. So cell phones, cell towers, smart boxes, pounding on us all day, all night. And these are very disruptive to our circulatory system and healthy cell reproduction. So what do you need to do? Well, you need to do the best you can. Um, the best you can can include the focus on what you eat and drink and make that as healthy as you can. Sustainable exercise is, is very important. I can tell you my observations from going out into places where there's a lot of people, just looking at them and uh, wondering what they're doing because we have an obesity crisis in the United States. It's obvious to me uh, going into the public places that I go. And um, that's sad. That means people are not paying attention. They're paying attention to what's being marketed to them. So I'm here as a advocate of health and wellness, as an educator of health and wellness, and not just one thing. Yes, I'm a big advocate and major representative of the device that I represent, the PEMF map that I represent that you use eight minutes twice a day. And if you don't know exactly what I'm talking about, then just look at my profile, you'll figure it out. And if you still haven't figured it out, I'm happy to send you a lot of information about this PMF device, a lot of information about nutrition, about healthy lifestyles, what I know. I'll give you the links of the people that I follow, the podcasts that I listen to, the YouTube videos that I watch, the books that I study, what I learned from, the doctors that I learned from, and what I gleaned from all of this. And I can tell you, I can tell you, the one thing that's missing from what everybody's talking about is what I talked about first. And that is what happens in our microvessel system and what significantly influences the electrical balancing, the circulation, and the detox in that microvessel system. They're not addressing it. So when they say, eat this particular type of food, don't eat this particular type of food, go on this type of a diet, that kind of a diet, it doesn't matter. The point is, well, it does matter because what they're advocating is generally uh, supported by science as being healthy. Although some of them that will find science to support their position and the, science and the actual health benefits um, are subject to question. That's not my point. That's, that's for you to decide what works for you. There's no one single answer that works for everybody. There isn't. Everybody's body is different 
And that's why when I read something that says, this is the exact formula that you should follow in order to have a healthy diet, I say, no. That could be true for a lot of people, but it doesn't necessarily mean it's true for everyone. So you gotta pay attention, you gotta study, you gotta think. And why is that important to think? Well, I don't know about you, but um, as I move onward in this life, I want to have energy. I want my brain to work fine. I don't want to have somebody have to take care of me physically. I don't want to be in a bed where people are feeding me and clothing me. I don't want that. I want to live a healthy, energetic, vibrant life with great mental acuity. And when it's time for me to leave, then I go. None of us get out of here alive. So it's a matter of how we spend our time while we're here. Now, on the subject of nutrition, I want to spend just a few minutes because it's going to be in, it's, you're going to find it in the article. I'm going to post the article to the comment section of this video and I want to talk about nutritional supplements. I am not an advocate in the past. I've not been uh, a major voice of nutritional supplements, although I've studied them, I've used them, I have my personal preference for certain things that I use, especially when it comes to meal replacement. But I've learned some things recently about nutritional supplements that I think everybody needs to know. And it has to do with the formulation of nutritional supplements. Formulation includes the combination of ingredients, the quantity of ingredients, and the form of ingredients. And there's a major science behind this, 40 plus years of research that had been fine-tuned in by a company that was working with the military. And I think it's fascinating. I, I love uh, the science behind this. I love the doctor and his credentials and all the work that he's done behind this. And I've learned, loved what he's taught me. And he's taught me some things that I just wasn't aware of when it comes to nutritional supplementation. And I'm a, I'm a fan of it. I'm a fan of nutritional supplementation because of what I said earlier. The, 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 the ground that we grow our food in is nutrition, nu nutrient deficient. Everything expo is exposed to toxins and chemicals. Everything. It's a big problem. And we've got to build up our defenses. So that's what I am, that's a purpose that I have for being on live video. And I haven't been on live video for a while, but you're gonna see more of me as soon as I get the technology even better. You'll, you'll, you'll see even more of me, maybe you don't want to. But I'm coming out anyway, because you need to be informed. You need to be informed on how to take care of yourself. And you need to know many of the things that we've become accustomed to liking, conditioned to liking, are really not good for us. We can recondition what we like for things that are really good for us. And in the meantime, I'm going to educate you more on the science behind what's really working in the nutritional supplement market. So the device I represent, nutritional supplements, health and wellness, health and wellness advocate, health and wellness educator, that's what I'm doing, that's my mission. I don't see me stopping as long as I'm on the face of this earth. I hope this helps you, I hope you like it, comment, tell me what else you would like me to talk about. And in the future, I have a lot more to talk about and I'll be sharing in future videos, I just don't want this to be too long. So my name is Steve Pollitt, contact me directly by text, 727-224-4743, 727-224-4743. Email me, Steve Pollitt, P-O-H-L-I-T, at gmail.com. I have tons of information. I will help you with all your questions. I will lead you to your own research if that's what you want to do. I will help you any way that I can in order for you to have a healthy, energetic, uh, mentally in tune life that's uh, wonderful for you and your relationships. Thank you for watching, I enjoyed this. I look forward to your comments.